So what's going on everybody? Now, I haven't did one of these type of trail reaction videos in a long, long time. I think the last time I did a video like this, it was for Iron Man 3. And to be honest with you guys, I only do trail reaction videos to move to trailers that I honestly love and I have something to talk about. And this Jurassic World trailer, I loved it. I absolutely geeked out about it. I mean, watching that trailer sent chills down my spine. I love this trailer. If you guys don't know, the original Jurassic Park that came out in the early 1990s is one of my all-time favorite movies. I'm talking about top five favorite movies. I love that movie to death. Me and that movie are inseparable. And this trailer has so much homage to the original movie. There are so much iconic shots that reminds you of the original movie. To the doors opening, to some of the uh, some of the Gallimimus running in the field. What this, what this trailer seems to me is that it's taking the original Jurassic Park and updating it into the 21st century with technology is more dominant than it was back in the past. And I think it's a great idea because now you're updating the original story. And I love that about it because Colin Trevor said that it's like, he said he's going to pay, he's going to make something new out of it, but also pay tribute to the original one. And from the trailer, from what I see from the trailer, it looks like he's doing exactly that. What Colin Trevor is doing, it looks like he has his own little spin to it. And it looks amazing from the visuals to some of the dinosaur shots to the, the, the SeaWorld amusement park scene looks great. I cannot wait for this movie. And my favorite shot from this movie is the very last one. It's Chris Pratt riding on a bike with Velociraptors. I mean, how cool is that? Ah, uh, I cannot wait for this movie. This movie, looking at the trailer for this movie, just brings back so many memories to the original one. I mean, it's probably not gonna be as good as the original one, but if it comes as close to that, I'll be more than satisfied. And I like the fact that Nick Robinson is in this movie because he'll get more mainstream attention because he was great in The Kings of Summer. And I'm glad he's in this type of movie that will branch out his career even more. And one thing I really like from this trailer is the fact that the way they use the iconic John Williams score, the score they use in this movie is so eerie. It's, it's also creepy at the same time. It's like when you do that, it just means that this is not the Jurassic Park you grew up on. This is something entirely different. And what I like about this trailer the most is the fact that it's given an opportunity for people who haven't seen Jurassic Park to get to experience this world for the first time. I like that fact about it because now people in their early 20s have not seen Jurassic Park. And I like this. I like that fact that now they updated it into the 21st century for people who haven't seen it. This trailer is 2 minutes and 30 seconds and I love every minute of it. You know what, I'm not, like, and for me, I'm not even going to rate the trailer, I just think it's epic. If you haven't seen it, I'll put the link down below. Definitely do check it out. So guys, let me know what you guys think of this Jurassic World trailer. Like it, hate it. For me, I absolutely love it. That's why I'm not going to give it a rating, because give it a trailer a rating doesn't really make sense to me anymore. So as always, guys, please rate, comment, and subscribe, and I'll catch you guys on the flip side.